Hi, I'm Maggie Downey from Personal Euphoria Pilates, and I'm going through a few exercises you can do on the foam roller to help reduce tension in your quads and to help um, break up the fascia a little bit, which you can do in massage, but you can also do using something like the foam roller. And the fascia is a good thing to break up because it has more muscle memory than muscle, and it's nice to kind of alleviate that. So, we're going to try to roll on our quads right now, and this is a great option if you have tight quads or for a lot of runners, this is something that's helpful for you. So what you're going to do is we're going to start with one leg at a time. You're going to start down at your knee, and you're on the front of your thigh, but kind of on towards the outside, but not all the way on your side like you're trying to hit the IT band. It's the front side of your quad, and you're just going to roll from the knee to the hip five times there. Back and forth. Again, you might feel some tender places. If you need to go slow, you can, but the more you do this, the less tender that should get. Three. Go all the way from your pelvis to your knee. Two. One. Then you're going to roll back and find any tight spots and just hit them and hang out. Try to relax. Okay. Once you've hit any of the tight spots, you can take a break if you need to, but then we're going to do both legs coming onto our quads, and from the knee to the pelvis, just roll back and forth for five. So now you're getting the center of the belly of those quads. You can go down on your forearms if that's more comfortable here and walk up. Your abs should be engaged so you're not sinking in your back, you're well supported. After five full range back and forth, you're going to bend your knees and do five again. This might feel even more tender, okay? For five, all the way from knee to pelvis, four, keep breathing and scooping the belly, three, lots of arms and abs here. If you can do two sets because your arms get tired, you do two instead of five and build up. One. And then again, any tight spots, you go back and you kind of hang out in the tight spot and try to relax. Notice that you're holding tension, especially because it feels tight. And then we'll roll on to the other side, the front side of that quad, and you'll go back and forth here. <sighs> Trying to breathe. Three. And two. And one. Find any tight spots and hang out there for a second, trying to relax. Now this is going to feel tender where you're rolling, but if it hurts anywhere else, your shoulders, your neck, your back, this might not be the best choice for you at this point. You can find another way to work this muscle and this fascia. And once you finish rolling through your legs, you're all set, and it should hopefully feel better at least when you're done.